Good morning. So today for the channel in the school summer holidays, the three brothers are, what are we doing guys? Blackberry picking. Who remembers doing this when they were kids? Nice. So we found a good spot. Fortunately, it's near the old fencing area that gets a bit overgrown in summer. But look, the boys are picking blackberries. Mason's eating most of them. Denon has to be the one that goes a bit too far trying to find the best blackberry in the dangerous area. Let's have a look what you've got in the uh, the jug for mum so far, first. There you go. I think there's some really, really big ones down there in the corner. So, yeah. tell me what mum can make with these guys. Jam. Jam. Pie. Jam, Jam pie, anything else? Um, then? Black currant. You black could make black some black sort of juice with them, yeah? Do you know what dad's going to use them for? Black. I'm going to put them, when I make porridge, I put them in the top of it and then I cook the porridge and then they all get warm and sort of pop and go into the porridge and they make the porridge like purple on top and beautiful. Plenty of vitamin C in there. Well, there's another one. So, who remembers doing this when they were kids? Me. Everybody on the channel. Who remembers all this and who does do this with their children, grandchildren, parents, friends? You know, these are lost little secret things that just a lot of children just don't get to do anymore for whatever reason. But it's funny because you can find blackberries anywhere, really. I think you've picked all the biggest ones out of here. But, you know, it's, it's, some, it's na na nature. It's learning about food. You know, the world we live in, the things that we eat, other creatures eat these as well. So we do leave some behind. Yeah. For what creatures eat these? Birds. Birds. Birds, worms. Well, I think hedgehogs have a go at them when they get when they're low enough. Ants. Yeah. So, you know, we're sharing the food of our crop, of our yield. And it's all good. And coming out, doing this for half an hour, with your family or your children is a great thing. You know, and then going home and washing them and then doing making something with them. It doesn't cost anything. You can find the, a bramble patch like this on the side of a road, as long as it's safe. On a park, on a path, they're everywhere. You know? And you can go and get a little jug or a box or a tub, even put them in your pocket if you had to. Bring them home wash them and then make something nice to eat with them and that is a that is a great thing and you don't get this time back and you want to enjoy it and mason's eating them all so let's let's hope he uh hasn't found any of the ones that needed washing a bit more so guys let's get together please denon denon's still getting them come on show me what you've got you ready? Denon's got blackberry sauce all over his juice, should I say. All over his hive heads because he's cycled here today, right? What do we do, guys? Well done, and there is the yield, right? Let me get a 